What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another video. Today, guys, we're back on Minecraft Times episode 10, guys. So, episode 10 is a big episode, as you can tell by the outdoors, guys. I've kind of set up a little bit for the mob spawner. As you can tell, I don't know if you can actually tell, but it is going to be gigantic, which is why I'm so thankful to actually be uploading again. Now, and you're probably like, SRM, you haven't even taken a break. Well, guys, I literally had to sit AFK on this world for like three hours last night, just waiting for these sheep back here. Wait, let me show you. Those sheep back there, I gathered all of them in with leads. I don't even know if there's any sheep around anymore. I gathered them like all in with like a lead that I had, right, guys? Uh, I think I have, I think, I think, I think I still have it, right? Did I put it down here? Let me see. Definitely not in there. Here it is. I, I took that lead out. I just got a bunch of sheep in there so it was easier. I just kind of watched YouTube and uh, sat AFK for a couple hours. And uh, yeah, I, I, yeah, basically that was it. I just harvested them out of all. Um, and then I also changed the farm a little bit to have cacti because I needed green wool for this. Um, obviously, it's a, it's a creeper-shaped mob spawner. So, And then I, you know, because I have the sugar cane now, I also made some bookshelves. So that's kind of all... Y'all missed off camera. N to be honest, it's it's really not that much. But you know, I gotta update you guys. So, uh, yeah. Do you want to see what my hard work has done? And I swear, if this isn't enough blocks, I am going to die. Look at this. I even had leftover dye because I thought I was gonna make a lot more. But then I decided that I was done for the night. <laughs> Respectfully so, though, guys. Look at this. I mean, guys, come on, dude. Like I, I. <sighs> I hope I never have to do this again, guys. This is going to be the biggest build in my world, and I'm never doing this again. Never, ever, ever. I'm not actually going to say that, because I, I don't know, but... Okay, <laughs> anyways. Um, so, guys, here's the thing. You know the funny thing, guys? I don't even know if the mob spawner is going to work. I don't know. I haven't, like, watched a tutorial or anything. I kind of just, like, did it on my own. Like, I kind of just predicted it on my own. So, if this doesn't work... Oh, I'm going to be so mad, dude. But, yeah, so we're just going to have to use this, guys, and we're going to have to place this all in here. Because, um, obviously, if you don't know, the creepers have, like, kind of checkered patterns on their feet. So let me just boop, 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 There we go. And I knew we were definitely going to have enough for this, because, like, obviously, you know, it's not that hard to do. Um, but... Um, the, the lime wool is what I'm worried about, which is why I got so unbelievably much of it. Um, and I still feel like I'm gonna run out. So if I do run out, I will finish this next video, because guys, I'm going to have two parts on the Moss Bunner. Uh, I'm gonna have two parts on this, um, whole, whole build, because of how just gigantic it is. Okay, um, so I, th I thought I'd just let you guys know. Uh, cause there will be two parts. So, episode 10, this episode, and episode 11 are both going to be centered around this mob spawner. Um, and, yeah, and I'm hoping I can get, like, some of it done today. If I can't, then, you know, that's that. Uh, I'll have to just sit for another two hours, which is not something I want to be doing. Like, contrary to popular belief, guys, I don't want to be sitting for my, like, just... Just sitting here for two hours, guys, because it really kills my PC, especially with RTX on. And I know you guys are probably saying, you can just turn it off, turn it off, turn it off. But here's the thing, I don't want to have to put it back on, so I'm, I'm just, you know, I'm just lazy, so, <laughs> you know. But, yeah, so, um, we're just going to build all of this up right here. We're definitely not going to have enough blocks, and I'm very, very sad, because, guys, we've gone down like a stack and a half already. And do you see how far we are? Do you see how far we are? into this build like we cannot be affording to lose this much blocks guys oh my gosh i didn't think it would take this much two hours is going down the dr every block i place is like 10 minutes guys i swear dude not actually it's like probably like five but no i don't even know it's probably not even five no it's not even five like it's like i don't even know i'm just gonna stop talking because uh, i'm talking because it makes me nervous like when i don't talk because you know i just need to cope with my with my anger to cope with my anger, man. Okay. I should be good with this. There we go. So, yeah. <laughs> Definitely not having enough, guys. I've gone through like two and a half stacks now. Uh, however, if we could just get up to the head, um, I would be happy with that. I would be completely happy if we just didn't do the middle part. If we could just build the head, which I don't even think we're going to get to. 
That's that's the thing. That, that That's how much I think we're going to have to do. I don't even think we're going to be able to finish the head. That It's crazy to think about that, isn't it? Uh, you know what's funny? How am I going to get down? Another thing about it that's not that funny, but how the heck am I going to get down from here? Like, I just thought about that. Because I had water buckets in the chest because of the mob spotter design, but I didn't bring them with me. Which was a little dumb of me, you know? It was not my smartest idea. I want to try to speed bridge so badly right now, but I don't have a water bucket to, like, clutch if I miss, so... We're not gonna be doing that. But look at this, guys. So we kind of got, like, the little outline of the head here. Um... Honestly, guys, if I don't get enough wool, I might just, like... I don't even know. I, I don't know what I'm gonna do, because we can't make this episode this short, guys. Like... <laughs> This is just gonna be me. Maybe we could just work on the inside bits and then we can finish it off, like, just building it wise next episode. That could be how it goes. But I don't know. Just depends, because I. You know, guys, I don't even know. I don't even know what to say. I'm just. I'm shell shocked that it's even taking this much wool. Guys, I have my fi I'm final stack. Final stack of wool, guys. This is crazy. As long as I can get the face done, actually, I'll be pretty happy, because then I can kind of see, like, what it'll kind of look like from my house. Which will be exciting. Actually. Um, well, there goes a piece of wool. We're gonna have to place that at the bottom. Um, because we're not coming all the way back up here to place one piece of wool down. Which is not how it's gonna work. Um, okay. Let's go like this. There we go. We've kind of gotten up here. And then... Let's, can we, like, kind of do this? There we go. That works. Oh, dude, look at this, man! And then let's just go like that, and there we go. So now, how do I get back down to there? Should I really try, guys? I kind of really, really, really want to try it. I kind of really want to try it. I'm just gonna, just gonna do it. I have faith! Yes. Okay, I had faith in myself. And I did it. Now it's just how I'm going to get down. And that's something I don't have faith in myself for. We're going to try to place the block. Um. Yeah, this is a... This is a problem, isn't it? Okay, wait, look at this. Look at this, guys. Amazing. Amazing. Oh my lord. Look at this amazing solution to get down here. Okay, look at that, dude. That's amazing. So we got the face done, and I know I still have some wool, but to be honest, I just kind of want to see how it looks. And I just want to see if it looks decent. Uh, okay, sheep, I'm going to need you. So can I just please shear you? Maybe I can make some more green wool. I don't think I'm going to be able to make too much, but I can probably make some more. All this. Oh my gosh. Look at it. Dude, it looks beautiful. It looks beautiful. Oh my gosh. Okay, wait, let me shear all these sheep back here, guys, because these are all ready to be sheared. Hey, guys. Back at it again. If you haven't already been sheared enough over the past day, I'm back here again. Okay. Every shear, every shear, every sheep has been sheared. I was about to say, every shear has been sheeped. Every shear has been sheeped. Okay, I'm going to take these now. Uh, and then I'm also going to probably take some cobblestone. And I'm also going to need those trap doors. Do I have trap doors? Yes, I do. Now, let me make 58 more pieces of lime wool. There we go. So now I have 63. Oh, come on. Come on, then. There we go. Uh... There we go. So I, I now have a stack in 16 again, which is kind of... Oh, wait. Can I see it from my bedroom? Wait. <gasps> Look at that. That is amazing. Look at it. You can see its feet, too. Oh, that's, that's, that's cool. That's cool. That's cool. That's really cool. That's going to be really cool for, like, the background of intros and stuff, guys. Oh, that's going to be so, so good. Also, guys, the tree farm has uh, grown. It's, like, all grown, and I like it. I love how it looks. It just looks absolutely amazing. I should probably go to bed first before I actually continue on this. Is there any sheep over here, though, that I can get while I'm out here? Um, there's one all the way over there. I don't know if that guy's worth it. Actually, yeah. Any sheep 
is worth it because oh, dude this build is so annoying bro it is look at how the sunset makes the world just look all red it's so weird look at the creeper it looks like maroon <laughs> i use maroon wool for its face that's funny look at that that's funny that is funny dude okay um let's see here hopefully the grass spreads back to that farm quickly um i keep saying sheep farm but i don't really know what other farm i'm talking about that i need grass to spread to because my other farm doesn't need grass it just look at that okay so some sheep already have their wool back um there we go let's go guys so oh dude look at that you can see through my window Oh, that's so cool. Like, when I'm sleeping, that's what I meant. Like, I obviously know I can see it through my window because I just looked, but you can see when I'm going to bed. Everything, and the grass looks like it's kind of starting to grow back up a tad. Um, that skeleton's gonna die over there. That? What? How does that? Um, I am so confused. Okay, we're just gonna go up here. We're gonna craft some of this wool. There we go. Look at that. And look at that, dude. So do I have a stack and a half exactly? Oh. Where was that? Oh my gosh, that could have been bad. That could have been bad. Here, come here, come here. Actually, I don't I don't want them on my property. Like, at all. Intense fight with the creeper. Oh, that was really close for him to blowing up. Okay, I don't know why that guy's looking at me but not fighting me. And I'll take it, honestly. I don't really want to fight him at this moment. I don't want to fight you. I don't, I don't, I don't. Oh, wait, dude. I keep forgetting stuff, guys. I need to go back for cobblestone. Because I want to work on the inside of it now. Because now I'm done with the outside for this episode. Um, except, like, you know, I still got this to fill in. But once I'm done with this, I'm done for the episode on the outside. So I need to work on the inside. I need to make myself semi-useful. I need to make myself semi-useful here. Because... If I don't get any work done on the inside this episode, then I'll need to work on the outside and the inside next episode, which is not something I'm looking to do, if I'm being honest. Um, and you know, fun fact, actually, guys, we're not going to need this part. Uh, we're not going to need these two all the way down. Because this will all be filled in with glass, which I don't think I brought with me. I did Of course I didn't. Why did I not bring the glass? Honestly, I need to start remember to just bring everything in the chest. Because I put it all in there for a reason. And that's because we're going to be using it. Oh, dude, I'm so... I, I, I can't do anything, right, guys? I literally can't. I can't do anything right nowadays. Um, dude, okay, what is going on, bro? What is going on? I don't know what's going on, guys. There we go. So, now let's build up here. Here we go, look at this. Oh my gosh, we are going to need so much wool for this part, and I don't like it at all. Oh, dude, I'm gonna need so much, guys. Well, it looks like you guys won't be seeing me for another year. Like, jeez. Oh my lord. Yeah, you guys definitely will not see me for a whole nother year on this channel, because of how much wool I'm going to need to collect before next episode. Oh my lord. Let's just say, those sheep, uh, they're just gonna not be able to grow wool anymore, honestly. That that farm's not permanent, by the way. We're probably gonna move them, we're probably gonna build a farm in the future and just move them to that official farm. But that's not like the official farm, guys, don't worry. Like, I'm gonna make it a little bit better than that, but for right now, that was like my little makeshift one that I made so I don't have to like keep going out and just finding new sheep. You know, I feel like it was just a, it was a little bit better for me. There we go. Look at this, guys. So we, now we got six pieces of wool left. We need to eat something here. I swear, dude, I burned through food so fast, too. And oh, my lord, I'm at two hearts. Okay, let me just... Okay. Now we'll be able to get down safely. Thank you, lord. Because, oh my lord, that was like a panic mission last time. Try to get down here. There we go. Look at that, dude. Look at that, man. Uh, now, let's let's shear some of these sheep. Because, you know, might as well. They're here. Let's go. Okay. Any wool counts, you know. Uh, so, yeah, that looks good. The only reason, guys, why I did that, you're probably like, I'm sorry, you need to build the inside. Is because I just want to see it from the outside and make sure it looks right. Because... 
I do have this built in my planning world, but, like, dude, the planning world one was just way too big. Like, guys, the planning world one was bigger than this. Like, it was crazy. Like, I couldn't do that. Like, it would just be too much wool. Because sometimes in my planning world, guys, I just forget to take into account that this world is entirely just, like, survival. So I don't have the creative tools that I have in my planning world. And I kind of forget that sometimes, I feel like. So, yeah. Um, yeah, it, was, it would have just been way too big. Way too big. And now we just need the water bucket back up here. There we go, look at this. We are getting back up here. Slowly but surely, without having to use any blocks either. So that's... that's look at that. Perfection, dude. There we go. Perfect. Now, we can actually create the lime wool up here. So that's pretty good. Let me just use this on this wall over here. Because honestly... Honestly... Uh, I think it would be pretty nice. There we go. So now, we need to build the insides of the spawner. Um, which we're probably gonna use... We need to find the center of this, so... Uh, safe to say... That the... The mob spawner itself... Is probably... Like, where the things are gonna spawn. It's probably gonna be somewhere up here. So can I just... There we go. Uh, oh no. No, please don't push me off. Please don't push me off. No. Oh my gosh. That was close. And I did not like how close that was. Okay. <laughs> there we go. So, let's go in here. Uh, we're gonna also make it just so that they cannot enter, like, any of these things. Like, we're just gonna put that in there so that nothing can spawn in this, like, you know what I mean? You guys know what I mean. In this eyeball thing, whatever you want to call it. I don't know. This mouth, I guess, actually. Because it's the, it's the creeper's mouth, so... There we go, look at that. And this is just so that the mob spawner, like, works correctly, I guess you could say. Um, dang it, how am I gonna get over there and, like, place all the blocks? Okay, here we go. It's gonna be on the same level as this, so it's gonna be like, bam, bam, bam. There we go. There we go, perfect. Okay. Little bit, a uh, little bit more risky than I thought it would be. We go like this, 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 and that. There we go. So now we're going to have to build out like this. And I don't even think this is going to be enough cobblestone, guys. But it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. And honestly, I think... Actually, it depends just how much this side is going to be over here. Whoop. And since this side is going to be like... I think it's going to be here. Here we go. So let's just build this out like this. Perfect. Look at that. Perfection. There we go. So now, let's make it a 4x4. Four four, and that'll make it 2 on this side, so that's perfect. And then if we do a 4x4 four four on this side, it'll... <gasps> no! No! Oh! oh my gosh! Dude, call me Dream, because oh my lord, I am amazing at Minecraft. Oh my gosh. Dude, my heart rate just stopped. My, my heart rate just stopped? My heart just stopped, okay? Oh my, what the actual heck. That was crazy. I am shocked that I just did that. Like, pure shocked. Honestly. Oh my lord. Oh no, oh no. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Just go like this. There you go. There you go, SRM. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm so shocked. Okay. That should be good. Uh, and then now we just need to do it on this other side here, which I don't even have a wall on, so it's going to be tough to do. So maybe I'll just have to go like this. And then start placing this over here. There we go. And then I could probably place this here. Just Grab the- oh, no, it's, it's long gone. Okay, I was hoping maybe I could, like, recover the pieces while I was up here, but probably not. So there we go. And then, look at this. This is amazing. This is amazing. Look at this. Because originally, guys, in my planning world, too, I had this as a sort of- oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. As a, uh, like, the, the mob spawning plates, like, where the mobs are gonna spawn, I had them as green wool, but- 
I then thought, like, what's the point of having that? Like, no one's gonna be in here to see this. You know, like, what's the point of having them green? Well, you might as well just have them cobblestone. So let's just go like this. There we go. Perfection. And there we go. I made sure to grab plenty of trapdoors, so I know we're gonna have enough, which is good. Look at this. Look at this, dude. Look at that. So this is what the kind of this is what the main thing is gonna sort of look like here. And then, guys, I don't actually know whether I want to continue this episode or drop it here. That's that's the tough thing with all these episodes, because like I want to keep going, but I don't want to keep going, because I want to save it for another episode. But I want to keep going, but I don't want to keep going. It's just oh, it's just so intense. But I think I will have to drop it here. I'm gonna just try a water box, water box, water bucket clutch. Um. Just to end off the video, Rika. So, if I die, I die. But anyways, I'll see you all in the next Minecraft Times episode 11. Goodbye! Bye-bye! 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 Why is my name Steve Isha? <laughs> Why is my name Steve Isha, dude? I remember I named myself that like two years ago.